Jean, um, last week was a bit of a mixture of stuff. Have you, did you have a, a good talk about what went wrong with the goal? Yeah, it's obviously concentration, obviously, um, you know, we've got to be more focused on set pieces, um, you know, and I'm, I'm responsible as well. I'm, I'm the leader at the back and, um, you know, I've got to get the boys going. So um, it's disappointing. Three games we've been leading and now uh, we've dropped points, so we've just got to get better at, it, better at it. You'd have a pretty good view from where you are of just when, when those holes are becoming available. What can you do about it? Yeah, obviously, I'm, like I said, I'm the last man in the back. I can see everything. Um, yeah, it's, it's communication and um, boys being switched on. So, um, you know, we've conceded a few goals like that. Uh, first week in Perth and uh, getting in Perth now. So we've just got to get better at it. Are you feeling a fair bit about? more pressure um, at the moment in the goals, given that the, there are those holes coming up in events semi semi I wouldn't say pressure. I think, it, um, you know, there's, there's always pressure on you. Um, like I said, uh, I've got to get better at it, the team's got to get better at it, um, and you know, we've we just got to keep improving. And uh, it's a focus thing, isn't it? So, um, you know, every time the ball's uh, you know, in play or um, when it's their throw in or their corner, we've just got to be switched on at, at all times and uh, not concede. So, the Newcastle coach said that uh, they tried a similar game style to implement as you guys this year, saw it didn't work, and, and threw it out. Are you happy just to be patient until it does fully work? Yeah, that, that, that's the coach's philosophy. He's not going to change anything. Um, I think we're getting better at it. Um, you take away the Newcastle game, it's probably our worst performance this year. Um, but take away that and uh, in the other games, we are getting better. And, uh, you know, it, it's going to take time. We're not going to, it's not going to change in two weeks. Um, you know, the results aren't good, but the, the way we're playing, it, it's not bad. And uh, we'll keep improving and our results will come. Do you think you get to a point where you need to get a result, though, to reinforce everything? And is that time sort of getting close now? Yeah, res the result bit obviously breeds confidence, and when you have confidence, it's probably uh, probably nicer to watch, and um, it'd be easier to play. So, um, you know, us players, we want we want to win games uh, definitely, um, but you know, we don't want to change the, the system, the, the philosophy the coach is trying to bring in. Um, so, it, it's a tough one, but um, like I said, we believe in the system, and we believe results will come. When you didn't uh, make the Socceroos squad, is Ange someone who would contact you directly or did you just take note of his comments in his first media conference? No, I think you know, Ange just picked his team and he's focused on the team he's got now. Um, you know, things change. Uh, you know, obviously they play tonight and uh, it's going to be good to watch. And um, you know, I think there's probably a squad of you know, 30 or 40 players that he's going to keep an eye on. You were heartened by the fact that he did refer to you in that media conference and said you were still in his thinking? Yeah, it's nice, I suppose. It would have been nice if I was picked, but uh, <laughs> I just, uh, yeah, no, like I said, it's going to be interesting to uh, watch and uh, see how Andrew's, uh, you know, soccer is go today. Do you feel there's a real chance to go to the World Cup now for you? Oh, I've always said I think it's a long way away, um, you know, and I've just got to do my best for the club, and if I do well, then I'll give myself a chance, but, um, you know, I, I haven't even really focused on it, to, to be honest. I've been focusing to get results and uh, trying to play uh, the coach's game style and uh, do well for the club. Just specifically on the, the defenders, are you confident with the group you've got there that, you know, they can sort out the, the few issues they've had this season and become pretty rock solid back there? Yeah, definitely. I think uh, Aussie's come in t uh, last week and I think he did a very good job. Um, you know, and you know we are conceding goals. We know that um, the game, the, the system that we play, it, it makes it hard um, unless we do keep the ball for long periods and uh, don't give it away cheaply. And I think that's what's kind of costing us giving the ball away. Uh, our defenders are wide, and our, our fullbacks are even wider. So when we give the ball away, everyone's um, pretty open, and um, we got to get better at keeping the ball and not giving it away um, easily in the midfield. Incentive needed for when you play victory, but uh, are you catching them in a moment of weakness? Two losses. Yeah, well, we're both, we both haven't been getting results, so um, I don't think that kind of matters in these games. I think players just want to go out there and, uh, um, you know, beat the opposition. And uh, it's, it's a good, good time for us to uh, meet them up in Melbourne. Um, you know, we, we obviously need to win and uh, we're going to be desperate. But in, in the same, same for them, they're going to be uh, desperate as well and they're going to need three points. But uh, if we beat them, then, like, you know, we're, not, we're going to be, you know, around the top five, six mark anyway. So um, we're, in a, we're not in a very bad position, uh, one or two wins on the trot, you look at Sydney and Newcastle and they're right back up there.